That's right, you can get a stealth hit if you get them while they're sleeping. Yeah, sneak strike. I'm gonna take all their weapons first. Actually, I don't- Ah, fuck! <laughs> Oh, that doesn't, doesn't explode. I thought it exploded if you just threw it. Yep. I am a big fan of Breath of the Wild. Maybe one of my favorite games ever. Uh, how is this possible on PC? Anything is possible on PC. I got my legally owned copy of Breath of the Wild for Wii U and used legal software to dump it on my legally owned and legally operating Wii U. Let's just put air quotes around all of this just for the sake of it. So legal. This is outrageously legal. The more I say it, the more legal it becomes. Really. This is the big shit right here. But... <sighs> Honestly, one of the things that had kept me from setting this up is I was like, okay, like you can play it normally, but what about the motion dungeons? What about the, the dipshit dungeons where you have to like use a big ol' motion controlled hammer to whack a ball and, <laughs> and like I'm sure that there's a million easy solutions for that but I was like it's not gonna be the developer intended experience and then I curled up in a ball in the corner and cried I cried and I farted it's not gonna be the <laughs> developer intended experience is this Wii U emulator yes it is a fully legal Wii U emulator it was a Nintendo lawyer who just threw his headset off god damn it he got us son of a bitch we had a noose around his neck, and then he had to say it was legal. Everyone talks about it as though it's like, Ooh, awesome. <laughs> you have to be able to get, get through the wall. I guess they could have put it on the bottom too. Oh, fuck. Where'd that block go? I'm gonna need that. Uh, I don't have a shield. Oh, uh, shaders. <laughs> fuck. Okay, we're gonna use dynamite technique here. Ah, whoa. I'm just gonna, if I can shove him into the water. Uh, uh. Fuck. <sighs> uh, 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 whoa. Oh. Okay. Come on! Oh, bitch! It's so slippery. There we go. Okay, so I, I'm gonna guess that, like, this is what running frame rate mods allows you to do. It doesn't seem like there's a cap on how quickly you can move. You can move objects around. Jeez. I gotta bonk myself with it, right? Whoa. <laughs> Poor Link. It keeps twirling. <laughs> I don't mean to be too, too grim or anything, but how do you want to be buried if money or physics wasn't a problem? Huh. Like when I'm dead, what to do with my corpse? I think it would be cool to like be loaded into a railgun and fired towards some... some like celestial body. If uh, If physics and logistics aren't a problem, like, put me in a capsule and just shoot me directly towards, like, Jupiter. Uh, and, like, let me just disappear into that maelstrom. Or into the sun. That'd be sick. Or just, like, yeah, having your having a, your body just impact into Mars. What if you could, yeah, if your body could get shot into Halley's Comet, so it just like travels around the solar system, and then maybe 3,000 years from now, when like, the human race's DNA has shifted due to technology or whatever, they find like some bo some bones like 10, f 10 meters below the surface of Halley's Comet, and they're like, ah, oh, we found, we found the remnant DNA of a pre-actualized human. And then they cram my DNA into an AI system that sequences out my entire life and rebirths me in VR. And then I'll wake up. I'll wake up except I'll be anime, an anime girl. An anime girl with huge knockers. And I'll giggle and play video games. And it'll be exactly like this, just 3,000 years from now. And I'll have giant anime boobs. Actually, by then the human race has probably evolved out of loving anime titties. Or maybe that's like the one thing that doesn't change. 
It's like we've transcended our need to eat food. We uh, we now subsist off of 3,000% sustainable algae formations that we can like recombinate to be any food that's ever been made. We don't need that anymore. Sex is quaint. Ugh. <laughs> but man, do we love staring at these giant anime titties. <laughs> okay, sure. Let's, let's... Yay! <laughs> My uncle works for Nintendo. Ask me how I got this shirt. Go ahead, ask. I bet you'll be impressed. Thanks, an IT guy. If he were an IT guy, he wouldn't be wearing a maroon shirt. Maybe if it's like one, a promotional shirt he got at like an IT conference or something. Linux Con 2021. No, there's no way. There's no way Linux Con shirts are not black. Are there Linux Con shirts? Fuck. All right, hold on. I <laughs> Does Linux Con exist? I have to know. Open Source Summit. Of course it's called that. Formerly Linux Con. All right. Oh, blue? Hold on. I mean, that's cute. Oh, the little pingy and little shark. I have to admit, I was expecting something else. Oh, wait, hold on. I don't care if this is an ad. Linux system administrator only because full-time multitasking ninja is not an actual job title. The AI have gone wild. Smart move putting it on black, though. But it seems as I've I've vastly underestimated the fashion sense of open source devotees. Why is Kanye? Oh, that's why. Okay. Excuse me. Ye. Or is it yay? Property. Yeah, there's the Lionel, by the way. Do do do. Oh fuck! 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 <gasps> Damn, I didn't know his vision was that long. I love that meter, too. It's just like, eh? I don't know. Must have been nothing. Well, let's see how this plays out. Yeah, I don't know about that one. I think he might want to kill me. Oh, fuck. Did not expect the... I guess I should have waited until nighttime if I wanted to try something like that. Lionel, you want to help out, bud? Nope. No! He's daring you to fuck with him? I'm not. I won't. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I don't know about these moblins. I might be able to blow them up and th throw them off the cliff here. Yep. Oh dear. If it breaks, then it'll probably... Nope. Nope. Yep. Fuck. And I don't have bomb plus. Fuck, I blew up my bridge. <laughs> Okay, that knocks these guys. Okay. Okay, I think we got... We're cooking with gas now. Yes! Ooh. There we go. Alright! No problem. Lateral problem solving. And an, an entire treasure, treasure trove of apples is my reward. Didn't kill them. They don't die. All right, well, let's get out of here. Gotta wait for them to go back to sleep, though. Nope, nope. It's it's out of position now. Oh! Oh! <laughs> I would freak out, too. God damn it. <laughs> I was hoping if I could kill him, then I'd get some monster parts and weapons out of it. But yeah, moral victory. But I gotta blow it up, right? I have to blow this up. Oops. Oh, weird. What a suspicious uh, rock formation. Oh wait, there's a search. There we go. What is this all about? What is this? What is this mysterious ice thing? I'm gonna blow it up. Mmm. I guess I need fire. I do have a fire arrow and a bomb arrow. I'm afraid if I shoot a fire arrow at it, the arrow will just like tink off and I'll get nothing. And I don't think a bomb arrow is gonna do anything either. I bet I have to actually cast fire on it. I'm gonna try this. Oh! Oh, fuck. God damn it. Alright. It was worth it. Maybe. I just wear board shorts. My entire wardrobe is loose fitting tees and board shorts. I sleep until 2 a.m. every day. Or 2. <laughs> Sorry, I sleep in until 11 a.m. Man, I got sniped. Ugh. 
Oh yeah, I gotta I gotta surf on my shield. Hold on. I can remember how. Nope. Gotta hop and then there we go. You have to hold it. There we go. Dan it. Dan it and dan it and did it and did it did it. Okay, that was fast. I never I didn't really learn how to do the like super hop. Also, that was the impression that I get. That's not that's not Superman. That's not the skateboarding song. The CDI Zeldas, yeah. I actually want to play those. I've never played the CDI Zeldas. I've watched enough playthroughs, and they look like, like as much as they get dunked on for their cutscenes, justifiably, the game itself doesn't look that bad. Gee, it sure is boring around here. Okay, all right. Huh. Off the plateau, and master mode is not hard. Playing my 100% legal backup on a 100% legal emulator. That's the equivalent of saying no copyright infringement intended in the description of a YouTube video. It means it means they can't touch you. Yeah, I do own a copy of the game. I guess technically. Uh, Nintendo lawyers, you can't listen to this part. Strike this from the record. My copy of the game is somewhere in the in the Berlin airport because my cartridge. I actually I have got it right here. Hold on. So this is my like Switch travel case. Uh, and there's these little pockets for Switch cartridges on the bottom here, they're, they're pretty useful. I don't have that many cartridges, but like I was picking it up and for some reason my finger just like slipped right through it. And like, like my finger caught on the bottom and just went boop and like, just like flicked it. And the cartridge shot out like a bullet and landed. A so this was in the, uh, uh, this was in like the security line, right? And you throw your luggage on that tray that has all those rollers. So you just slide it into the security. I was on the other side of security. I was picking up my like, my carrying case, my finger fired it out of the thing, and then it like dropped in between the rollers, and I was like, ah! And I like looked in between the rollers with my flashlight, and God help, God bless the people who are working there, because they tried too. They were like looking around for it, and they were just like, uh, I don't think there's any way to get under this, because we were just kind of looking at that giant rolly thing, and there was there's not like a panel or anything you can pop open to look under it, so. Fucking this fucking thing. Man. This, this next part is a bitch, as I recall. Oh, they joke about it in the game itself? Good. Ah, fuck. Uh, Prometheus? I think. F oh, that's gonna kill me. Okay. No! Oh, are you kidding me? Fuck it. I'll just die. <laughs> Yeah. Uh, oh! Clutch. Oh yeah, that's right. Zeldas usually have death counters. So. My 100% no death run has been destroyed. Better delete it. Uninstall Simu. Snap my 100% legal Wii U copy of Breath of the Wild in half. Oops. Maybe that one wasn't so good. Darn it. <laughs> Alright, there we go. I just want a little nick. Damn it, that's not... It's still too much. It's still gonna just rest there. Blech. Yeah, there we are. Hoo! That's right. <laughs> God. Oh, too high again. Seems like it should be so easy. Oh, there we go. Oh, first beetle of the run. I love his cutoff shirt. He's got his little tray. Ready to do business. Look at this stupid idiot. I do really like chickens. I love I love thinking that they're just tiny little dinosaurs. Stupid dinosaurs. All they do is walk around and peck at things. Scratch at the ground and peck and stand. They look majestic in a dumb way. Yeah, that's that's the perfect description of a chicken. It stands like a proud animal, but the second it moves or does anything, you're like, oh. <laughs>
Fun fact, chickens are descendants of the jungle fowl, hence why they're so very colorful. Even the white ones are pearlescent. And jungle fowl. Those had to be some hard-ass chickens. Prison chickens. Like straight-up velociraptor chickens. Slicing necks with their, like, feet claws. Jumping and scratching at things. Pecking. Pecking and picking. Yeah. Oh, the doggy's chasing his tail! Yay! What's this? Suspicious rock! Oh, it is just a rock. Oh, I'm sorry! I think I can knock them off. I wonder if I can still do the leaf. Ooh! I if I'm dead. Ugh. I need to get them over here. Ugh. Ooh. Oh, wow, the reach! The reach on that poke! Why does he keep twirling? <laughs> That happened- that's happened twice now. Uh-oh. What's this? Oh, whoa. <laughs> Doth I detect a seed? One thing out of place. I know what to do in this situation. Yes. Oops. <laughs> that air horn! Meep! <laughs> Who's blowing that horn? Oh yeah, it's time for Big Woman. Why did everyone... Everyone freaked out about Lady Domitresque and here's here's the breath of the wild fairies. Being the atom bomb thick-ass queens that we love. As a result, her power has abandoned you. I love how the fairies like, they're just like, oh, I just need money. Oh, I'm just so weak, I can't. I just need like $500. <laughs> Man, these ladies are the best. Just, I need your rupees. I need that money. Oh, it's a hundred. Okay. I think I can I can swing that. How tragic. How dreadfully tragic. It's just going back to sleep. Uh, very literally won't get out of bed for less than a hundred rupees. She's a Baptist pastor. <laughs> no salvation for you. Only fairies? I mean I think I think the Hylian fairies would do very well on OnlyFans. My 2022 goal is to, I want to get down to like one, 190, I think I would consider a success. And that's 30 pounds. Believe it or not, I have 30 pounds to drop. I don't think you guys are ready though. If, if I get abs, I'm going to be unstoppable. They're going to cast me to replace The Rock in Fast and Furious 10. And then I won't have time to stream as much. But that's just, that's just a sacrifice I'll have to make. I've, I've already, I've already did, done a little knob slobbering with my, with my man Bruce already, but I am so thankful that he's in my life because he's so, uh, extroverted and so good at, like, forming social connections and finds just, like, good, good people that I'm able to meet a lot of great people through him, so. Okay, well, I guess I can go pay off the ferry. Oh crap. I'm playing tag with a child. This is not... This is not, uh... Paying off a fairy. I'm dead, just throw me in the trash.